Hello everyone, welcome back to my last play of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, and we're continuing on the Lakebed Temple, the third dungeon of this game. And obviously we made the water wheel move, so now that thing's moving great, so now we can go all the way back to the other room and do stuff. I'm not sure if we're supposed to go here again, nope, we weren't. Or maybe we do. Nope, same room. My bad. Okay, so now it looks like we're supposed to go over here then. You're never gonna run me over enemy and I don't, and I don't know what you're called. Oh, yep. Little cutscene. And it makes that water move. Oh. Once. So now I probably have access to new areas. I die, you tectite. You're of no use to me. And whoop. Oh yeah. Okay. You must die. Okay, please be this is please be the right room where we're supposed to go. Alright. Dang it. Please don't tell me I'm gonna get lost again. Dang it. Maybe this is where we have to go. Dang it. That's completely the beginning of the dungeon. Wow, looks like we're lost. Or stuck for that matter. No. So maybe over here. Ah oh, dang it. We're lost. Or maybe not. Huh. I'm pretty sure this might be the way we're supposed to go. Dang it! Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Well, it looks like we're uh, pretty much getting lost. Oh boy. Who knew this would be this hard? This hard. Huh. Oh no, no hearts. Dang it! Oh man. <laughs> We might actually be at the right place. Oh, I think we are. I'm pretty sure we are. Yes, we are. Thank God. Okay, so... Now that this is moving, we can go over to that door. Okay. So just keep on waiting, keep on waiting. Let's see what's in here. 
Uh, so obviously we have two choices. We're gonna get in here and get a small key. Yay, we got a small key. And I'm gonna completely ignore you guys. Cause that's the way uh, <laughs> you like it. Oh, what is this? It's, is it gonna be the mini bus? <laughs> what? What? We have a small key. What will that mean? Okay, so obviously I was going the right, wrong way this whole time. Oh, oh well, at least I got this small key. So now I'm pretty sure we can get into that one door at the main room. That's pretty much all that. Or, we can actually go in this door. <laughs> okay, heart, thank you. I'm going to need it. <laughs> well, wow, I really thought this would be the the uh the way to the mini boss <laughs> obviously not yellow ruby really I don't even need that right now another yellow ruby anyways what actually what you can do is you can just walk use the these iron boots to walk over here. Oh, I gotta stop doing that. Anyways, we're just gonna have to set the ropes to normal so we can run this rock. Or I'm pretty sure you can use the arrows, but it's just an easier way that I like to do. Ah, don't eat me clam. Hmm, where are we? Hmm, this is a really big room. What the? Oh my gosh! What is that thing? Holy crap! It's weird! Okay. <laughs> well, looks like we're gonna have to fight the mini boss. Which I have no clue what it's called. I told you he's gonna jump up in the sky and he's gonna try to land on you, but you're gonna run away and then and uh, hit his arm or his tongue, I mean. That's pretty much what you have to do, so just roots and repeat and then you'll kill him. Yep, this is the mini boss. Of course, yeah, he's sending his little enemies to kill us. Which we're not gonna let him do so! Cause we're more epic than he is. It look kinda like this guy's boss style. Okay, here we go, here we go. Ah, run away! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Okay! I, I'm pretty much guessing that, okay. Alright, we're running out of time, so stay tuned to the next part Let's Play 4, The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe for the next episode. Goodbye!